Hello, hello. Welcome on into another episode of the Whiskey Crusaders. I'm Will. I'm Sarah. I'm Matt. Today we're talking about Rocktown and their Arkansas rye. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and click that notification bell. Matt, why don't you tell us a little bit about this Rocktown? All right. Rocktown, Arkansas rye, donated by our, our good friend Stella Matrix. Thank you very much. Greatly appreciate this. And especially when we got this, I think, four years ago. So pretty awesome. We're getting to your fourth bottle you gave us. So thank you very much. We are consistent one year of rock towns from you. So great job. Thank you so much. Uh, like I said, this is 46%. This rye is the first one to come out of Arkansas. It is growing 125 miles from the distillery in southeast Arkansas. It is 15 months old. This is batch 16. 50%, 56% rye, 34 corn, 10 malted barley, and a 25-gallon barrel. And then the new ones I found on the website are now at least two years old. So have straight with straight rye, which is cool. Let's see what we think about this rye. Smells very nice. Smells, uh, ooh, yeah, very different, which I like. Yeah. Rye Gee. bread, super it's minty doughy. spearmint, black pepper, yes. uncooked dough, it's, little anise. It's pizza dough before it goes into the oven. Yeah, yeah exactly. It's uncooked dough. I yeah. like it. Yeah, and you like threw some like rye spice on it. A little bit of pepper. It's got yeah. some spearmint going on. Mm -hmm. It's also got. I want to call it green bean. Green. Okay, I can see it's, that. It's a green. It's not asparagus, but it's a green vegetable being cooked I, up. Bell pepper. Maybe bell uh, pepper. I don't think it's that spicy. I think you're right. I think green bean itself might be the actual correct. Like sautéed. Yeah. Okay. A little bit of like. Sure. It's just a weird note to get, but it's yeah. A little bit of like mushroom funk to it. It's super interesting. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like that nose. That's unique. Hmm. All right. It does smell a little young. Mm -hmm. well, it's 15 it's months, 15 so that's months. not a surprise. I mean, the distillery had opened yeah. that long made this. Yeah, I mean, this smells to me some some kind of like uh, some of the younger Balconist ones from mm -hmm. earlier releases. Yeah, I mean, the earliest this could have gotten from was like 2019, so. Right. Or latest, so, Yeah. <laughs> Because that's when she was right. here. Hmm. Tastes nice. Nice yeah. rye. It's Winter fresh spearmint. It, it, it tastes nice. It's not like, oh my god, but it's yeah, not like that's nice. Either. Black pepper. It's, it's nice. It's got black pepper. It's got dough. spearmint. Doughy. Coffee. Little brown sugar. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Mm -hmm. The age is prevalent. It doesn't taste rich or thick or viscous, yeah. but the flavors that are presenting themselves are all really wonderful. Yeah. And to me, this is like a great stepping stone. Yeah. yeah, yeah to older rise. Well, yeah, and, and just, no, I'm just thinking like what these guys have, if they have more stuff laid down, that's going to be aged up. It's going yeah. to be really just gonna spectacular. Keep growing and growing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, because the flavors that are here are really phenomenal. If we can add yeah. a, little bit of depth, a little bit of complexity to this, this is going to be wonderful. I would really like to, since these are all stuff that's from at least four years ago, what their new stuff tastes like. I think it'll be because I know we've liked every product we've tried from these guys. It'd be super yeah. interesting to see what they taste like now. Absolutely. Yeah, these, I'm, I've been very impressed with the young I, stuff they put out. It's been very good. Yeah. I don't have really anything negative to say about it. It's it's no, it's it's good. It does it's taste good. young, but you That's, know, yeah, it, 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 it is, is young, what it is. So, yeah. yeah, it's like it was twenty five, thirty bucks. They're not expensive either. Oh, I mean, so okay. you can't beat the price. I mean, I'm not mad about that. I'm not mad about that at yeah. all. Not at all. No, I mean, yeah, craft, You're doing it right. You're doing local. I mean, I, I have no complaints. Like they're doing everything the right way. Yeah, I'm interested to see what continues to come out. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So, yeah. hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll get it in Texas soon. Yeah, that'd be even better. There you go. But we'll see. Well, Stellar Matrix, thank you very much. We really thank appreciate you. it. It was a Good. fantastic uh, run of different rock towns from you. So we greatly appreciate it. Yes. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and click that notification bell. Come hang out with us live on Monday nights and be sure to check out our Patreon for behind the scenes fun. And until next time, keep on crusading for the whiskey in your glass. Cheers. Cheers.
As long as it's not Alabama style. Oh, not a fan of uh, bullshit. It's that uh, fucking uh, Clyde Mays. MGP bullshit. I call that. Also accurate. Is it sad when I think the 15 month one's the best one we tried today? <laughs> uh, Loki. Wow. Loki. It really is, though, isn't it? 